Hey guys, I'm Julius from CloudTech.com and today I want to show you one of our newest flagship models. The Sea Carrier made by Geist Design and co-branded with Umbrella Armory and obviously CloudTech. We're pretty proud of this product because we've gone a long way to design a fully integrated system that is modular and allows you to make changes on the fly. So everything that you see on the system has been built in a way to be adaptive. Your front panel, your backpack, the front panel on the back, the cover bund, everything is adjustable, everything is made to be fast, everything is made to be comfortable, and everything is designed around your specific needs. So whenever you make changes, you can come to the system, revisit it on the fly, on the field, and make the adjustments that you need to have the perfect system for whatever mission specific needs you have in that very moment. So today I want to go over the two versions that we'll be offering. One, the one that you see here, the fully set package with everything you would ever need in a plate carrier and with all the modularity that you would need on the field. On the other hand, we're looking at the vanilla version, a fully stripped package where you can bring in your own front panel, your own backpack and whatever other attachments that you want to molly onto the system or use the G-hooks or the Swift buckle system to attach anything that you might need. So let's dive right into it and see what we can do with the system. First things first, I want to talk about the front of your plate carrier and let's cover every feature that we have here. Most importantly for me, when I set up my plate carrier, I want to make sure that I don't get tangled up with any of my equipment such as like audio equipment, push to talks or whatever other wiring uh, that you may need for water supply or anything else that you need on the carrier. As you can see, we have two little loops on each side, on the front and the back, that allows you to route your wires as well as having wiring options and routing options on the cummerbund, allowing you to keep everything away from your body and making sure that nothing has tangling loose on the sides that could get you strapped on. More importantly, we also have a big admin panel. So whatever you need on the field um, that you just need to pull out real quick and have a look on, your phone, a map, small little items that you want to carry with you at all times, you can store them in here. Throw your batteries in there, whatever you might need uh, that helps you stay organized. And the next thing that you guys are might, uh, might be wondering about is that you can probably not see is that the whole front panel is hooked on with two G-hooks and Velcro. That makes it removable and that also gives you the option to use these little guys here, the Nexus buckles, which go right here and there, we're shipping these with every carrier, that allow you to switch to any other front panel system that you might be accustomed to, be it your Haley, be it your, uh, your Spiritus, you can just throw anything on there using the ITW Nexus buckles and that gives you full compatibility. So if you go with the vanilla version, this will give you the option to throw anything on there that you might already have in your um, apparel, in your, uh, in your house, that you might just want to add to the system. As you can see, the front panel that comes with the carrier is made by Guy's Design, and it includes space for three M4, M16 style uh, magazines, and has the Kydex retention in there. So you will have a really like tight retention but it will also make it easy to pull out, reinsert, or get, keep yourself organized. And many people are wondering, will this keep your magazines in there when you're running, when you're falling, when you're jumping, when you're in the action? And the answer is pretty much yes. Unless you get stuck on something and that pulls out the whole magazine like you would with your hand, then surely they will come out. But other than that, they will be staying in there pretty much for sure. The full version of the plate carrier comes with a front panel system that is set up for three magazines of the AR-15, M4, M16 style. You can bring all those on the field and additionally you can mount anything on the molly so that you can bring additional pistol, M4, AK or whatever other kind of retention you need um, such as utility pouches onto the field. As well you can see the buckles down here so in case you need to attach anything like grenades or other utilities um, that's no problem you can just hang them on there. Alright so now let's dive a little bit deeper by going all the way around the carrier. First, let's look at our shoulder straps and cummerbund. I know that many guys out there don't like cummerbunds because they're accustomed to those stiff ones that are in one position that kind of feel like they're contracting your body and restricting your breathing. So what we did is we went with a fully elastic cummerbund system that will not only hold all sorts of utility, such as magazines, additional uh, communications equipment, or even grenades, smoke grenades, flashbangs, whatever you want to carry on your sides, that you need to have easy access to, but might not need at all times. So I see some people like putting additional magazines in there and they will switch them out later on. Once one mag is empty, they will just switch to a new fresh mag. And you can use that as a way to keep yourself organized without having to throw magazines away, put them in your dump pouch, 
or just generally um, having to access your backpack for any kind of like utilitarian needs that you might have. So let's go from top to bottom. For the shoulder straps, what's really important is to just really stay comfortable. So you have this padded system right here. You have a little bit of um, Velcro on the top so you can add additional like IR stuff or whatever you might need to route things or other attachments that you go for with your carrier. But I think obviously what's most important for you is, is this adjustable and does it fit me? This is fully adjustable because we have a Velcro system on the inside that just closes and keeps it in position and also gives you the ability to just take off the cover here, you slide this off, and then just adjust the Velcro with one or two steps and you keep yourself organized and you keep yourself uh, very comfortable with the system. So going down we have the cummerbund system which is also adjustable via Velcro so you can make it really wide by pulling the Velcro apart or you can just keep it really closed so you have a tight fit. But as I said already with the elastic cummerbund once you have it set if you want to have a little bit more space it will really give you that space, or if you're breathing heavily and, you're and, you're, and your thorax is expanding, you will have that breathing room in there. As well as having other magazines or stuff in there that you're carrying with you, it will not get into your way as much as usually. So when you do carry a lot of things, you may want to adjust this, make it a little bit wider, give yourself a little bit more breathing room, but other than that, you should be fully set with the system as is. So you could just throw this on, adjust your shoulder straps, and you'll probably be likely to be ready to go and not have to worry about anything contracting your body or anything like that. So let's swivel this around and see what we have in terms of carrying capabilities. So here in the back, we have a backpack with about 10, 12 liters of volume. It opens like a clamshell, so it's like really accessible. It just folds all the way open. Everything that's in there will be exposed. We have a lining of Velcro on the inside that I'll show you later that will help yourself keep organized and also when you open this in a quick situation you won't have any issues with something falling out because it can be molly or strapped on right onto the inside. So how does this whole thing attach to the back panel of your, of your plate gear? You might see that there's two G-hooks again on the back side that make sure that you stay retained up to the top of the carrier and then as you go down you will see a Velcro completely covering the back panel, allowing you to strap on this uh, backpack entirely and as well keeping it retained with this reten retention strap. This retention strap is also elastic, meaning that not only does it keep your backpack and your plate back attached to each other, this means that you're going to have a very tight profile and you will have a way to keep everything compressed even when there's a lot of stuff in there. So right now let's look at what we have back here, the pro version does actually come with a fully set kit. So that, you, that means that you have another placard system in the back that has a front panel together with Kydex allowing you to mount three more magazines in the back as well as in the front as we looked at earlier and a full Molly back uh, panel that allows you to put on any additional pouches or whatever um, utility, uh, utility needs that you might have. So that will cover the whole front of the plate carrier. I think it's a good time to now turn this thing around and look at the other side of the system to go a little bit deeper on what we have in the back in terms of the plate carrying, um, adaptability for a backpack, any backpack that you might want to bring on, as well as a whole extra set of Kydex retention for um, like just resupplying or helping out your teammate when they do need ammunition. So let's dive right into this and uh, see what other features we have here in the back. So another good feature is that in case you want to add an, an additional placard system, an additional front panel to the back, you can do so with the uh, Swift Clips as well. So you, have, you give yourself all the adaptability that you would ever need and in case you have additional gear that you want to run with this plate carrier, it's entirely adjustable. So whatever you have laying around, it will probably fit on here. Um, another interesting feature is that we have wire routing for your hydration, for your battery, for your electricity, whatever you might be running in your system. I know we're getting pretty advanced these days. Um, on either side, you're going to have an uh, elastic flap that allows you to push anything through, but keep also stuff inside that you don't want to have falling out in case you're running. That's why it's like elastic and uh, it's just like tightening down the entire area of it here. Going around, we have the YKK Zippers, obviously a brand that you guys are all accustomed to, uh, know and love, and it's something that will stay tried and true uh, in throughout any situation. Opens really quick, opens very easily, and as we all know, that it stays clean and it stays intact even for prolonged uh, use. Alright guys, this is it for this video going over the C-Carrier and all its features. Today we looked at how the full Pro version is set up, 
giving you a kit overview with all the features that this kit comes with, not covering the armor vent system, which is an optional feature for you guys to check out as well. So in the future, we're going to go over the vanilla version, which is this whole set without all the additional features, backpack, and retention that we've just went over. So in case you guys are interested in that, we're going to release a full customization software where you will be able to explore the carry without the additional options and pick and choose which ones of the features you would like to have in your system and build your kit from there. So I appreciate you guys hung in until the end of this video and look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you very much for tuning in.